Hey Simmers, so welcome to my channel. Welcome back if you've been here before. This video is about how to have a strip club in your game in The Sims 4 using the Wicked Whims mod and Get to Work pack that you actually don't have to own and operate and can have your Sims show up to as clients. My last two videos were about how to make money and how to actually open a strip club as the owner. This one is strictly about the client experience. So if you like this type of content, please be sure to subscribe to my channel and like this video. So if like me, you've ever had a strip club and then you're, you're just tired of going to work with your sims and you want them to move on to other stuff so you use the option on the phone to sell the strip club you get the money and then you think i can still just like a restaurant or a retail business have my sims go back to the strip club maybe get a lap dance get a drink or whatever but then you go back to it and it's totally deserted and doesn't work um that's because this is a mod and it just does not it doesn't work that way but there is a workaround. So I'm gonna show you how to actually transfer ownership of a strip club and keep it open so your Sims can actually continue to show up and employees will spawn, they'll be able to get a lap dance or buy a drink or whatever. Rule number one, if you want to transfer ownership of a strip club and you wanna keep it functional, do not sell it from your phone or the business panel because if you do you'll get the money but the strip club will no longer function so I'm going to show you how to keep the strip club functional but before I do I'm going to show you the client side now if you happen to watch any of my last videos you've probably seen the sims on the screen Kobe and Kendall they are strip club owners but they also like to go to the strip club and enjoy the services at the strip club when a sim travels to a strip club they don't own and you click on the lot it shows who the owner actually is and also under the lot name when you show up to the lot as long as the strip club is owned it will operate the strip club being featured in this video is the stargazer strip club formerly the stargazer lounge on the rooftop in san maishuno if you would like to download it it is in, on the gallery and i will leave my gallery id in the description now when sims show up to the strip club as clients instead of owners the interactions are different so they can click on dancers that are on the task of charming and greet them they can also interact with stage dancers by clicking on the stage dancer and then strip club and then they have the option to tip the dancer watch the dance or even change the dance another option is to get lap dances so they can click on dancers that are assigned the task of charming also and then click strip club and they can ask for a private dance and if there are private dance spots available the dancer will take the sim back to the private dance spot and perform a private dance they can also of course just sit at the bar and get drinks and socialize if they don't want to do any of that okay so now i'm going to kind of demonstrate how to transfer ownership of the strip club so the way that strip clubs or businesses in general are owned in the sims is by household so in order to get rid of the strip club you have to move out of a household or kind of transfer from one household to another so i'll show you how i'm going to do this with this particular strip club it's owned by jade rosa um, and i'm going to transfer this ownership to other sims so i'm going to send jade home and then i'm actually going to go into manage worlds and pick some random sims um, living in a world move them into her household and move her out so they're left with the strip club and she doesn't um, have it anymore so i suggest that while you're doing this do not save anything like just go into manage worlds don't choose the save option you want to make sure you have this correct without losing your strip club after you make sure everything's good at that point you can save your game but until then i suggest just don't um, basically there's multiple ways you could do this the whole gist of this is to leave the strip club with sims that you're not playing so that you can actually show up with the sims you are playing as clients now you could use a sim from create a sim you could um, pick one from the gallery whatever you want to do in this case i'm picking some random sims living in the town this is the Powa household kalama and Lacey living in the penthouse in san maishuno i'm gonna manage worlds and then i'm gonna move them and i'm gonna choose the option to move in 
because we want all of them to be in this house and sell the furniture so the furniture actually stays at the penthouse because eventually they're going back to their house because everybody's going to be back there where they were. The difference will be that Kalama and Lacey own the strip club and Jade no longer owns the strip club. So when this comes back up, as you can see, all three of them have ownership of the strip club. They all live in the same household. And so um, I'm going to move them because they need to be back in the penthouse so Jade can move out back to the house she's living in now. So at this point, I'm gonna go um, move the Sims. So as you can see, the household name is still Rosa, which you can actually change in the Manage World screens. Sell the furniture again, so the furniture stays back at that house. And then when they come up in the penthouse, they actually still own the strip club. So all three of them still own the strip club. So now I need to move Jade back to her old house. So Kalama and Lacey will keep the strip club and she will no longer have it. So I'm gonna go ahead and have her move out, split from household and move out. So when you split from the household, you leave whatever businesses the household owns behind. So that's what she's doing, splitting from the household and she's gonna go back to her old house. I need to give her some money so she can buy her old house. So I'm giving her the money, moving her out. And as I mentioned, you could just add a sim to her household and create a sim, maybe in a neutral household and then move her back. But hopefully you understand what's going on here and you can do it however you want to. But like I said, don't save until you make sure you've done this correctly. So now she's back at her house. And if I'm to look at the business panel, she doesn't own any businesses anymore. It's just Jade back in her house. So I'm going to show you the other household and show you what it looks like over there and also what the strip club looks like so you can see that it's still intact and functional. Maybe at some point the mod creator will make it so maybe you can just place a strip club and it will function. Um, that would be really interesting to see what kind of employees show up there. But at the time that I'm making this video, it just won't work that way. So I wish somebody had told me that I could do this earlier so I could actually have a strip club that I could have my Sims just go to and not always have to play because it is a lot of work. So anyway, we're back at the penthouse. And as you can see, the Powa household actually owns the Stargazer strip club now. So I'm gonna have Kalama travel to the Stargazer strip club so we can make sure that the employees are there. Uh, because the the strip club will stay open as long as you have an owner but you definitely want to make sure that you have employees and if you want to check time to time if you're not playing the household I think you should probably go back in there and make sure the employees are still there because sometimes they get unalived and you need to hire <laughs> a new employee so it's probably good to go back in and play the household occasionally so you can make sure the strip club is being maintained I also suggest that when you transfer ownership of the strip club, you choose a household that has more than one sim because if one sim becomes unalive, then basically the strip club is closed and it's lost the same way it is if you sell it on your phone. So you don't want that to happen. So Kalama is now at Stargazer Strip Club and we have all of the same employees there, so at this point I could just save, I can go back to my Sims that I want to play and then save my game. And any Sim household, except for the owners, can actually show up as clients and enjoy the strip club. So I hope this helps. I hope somebody needed to hear this. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.